there was a time when sea beasts would ravage our shores, and no ship was safe on the sea. There's nothing like a good story at sea. And this is the kind of movie you hope is as good as it looks. And to me, it delivered, from the impressive physics, beautiful art direction, and immaculate visual execution. To a proper story with a good message and symbolism, charming and colorful characters, and dialogue that is never wasted or unnecessary. In fact, there's a lot of appreciated visual storytelling. Just one look or one scene, and you can easily put yourself in the shoes of the cast. And while there is little to be said that hasn't been said before, it manages to create a bountiful world and story worth watching, people might compare it to a certain dragon film, and doesn't detract this one from existing. Personally I liked this one best, but I'm glad there's just more, colors, to enjoy for everyone, I only wonder if we'll see more of it, though I don't think we should. But one rarely ever knows what we want, until we are surprised with it, as the movie said. I have everything I need right here, the red beast, huge like fish, is how the story got its new beginning. The plot is about doing good, living a great life and dying a great death, shouldn't be about fighting the so-claimed monsters rather, living in peace with them. It's about doing what's right for the greater good and telling the truth. Not selling more lies for our own benefits and to satisfy our greed, it's a very nice anime about lots of great meanings, high recommended.